I found out late in life, I was so mad because I started, I found out when I was 58 oh. and, and so that didn't give me a, I didn't really get it started till my sixth decade. Yeah. But you know what? Yeah. But you know what? It's still going to work. out. I just have to put more in, but I'm in good health. So yeah. I was rated at good rate and I'm able to get, you know, a really good deal. But the thing about it is what it does. Now mm -hmm. think about this, where we're at in the world, the money comes out tax free. Yeah. I love that. Tax free. Exactly. <laughs> and, and, right. And if you're in the 40% tax bracket, you know, and you're getting that, or that money is worth 40% I mean, more. 14 point, whatever it is I pay. Oh my gosh, it's mind boggling. Yeah. So, no, imagine. I love it. real estate because we can hedge it with the depreciations, paper losses, all that stuff. <laughs> right. Right. But even that's volatile. So I like a, a mix between volatility, mm -hmm. you know, a little real estate. Okay. But some safe products that you yeah. know is going to be there because when the market resets too, the rents will go down. So all of it changes. So in thinking in the long term, when you're making your mix of your money, you want to make sure you have that safe money. Now, yeah. these index universal life products that I use have a bunch of benefits in them. Hmm. Got to have health. So they're underwritten. Okay. But the money comes out tax free. So mm -hmm. like I was saying, if you're in the 40 percent or 40, whatever you are in, you multiply that. So it would be worth 40% more the money coming out because you're not paying taxes on it, right? right? Basically. Yes. yes. It is it is so it's so cool how it works. Then here's another one. Inside of these things, they have catastrophic illness protection. Mm. Now, in the pandemic world we're we're in, you know, it used to be seven out of 10 of us over 65 end up in a nursing home. But now it's probably nine out of 10, right? So and, true. that's what I'm in business now. For three years, I'm building senior assisted livings. Action Manor mm -hmm. CEO. I'm just being telling everybody listening. Yes. Yes. That's our brand, my partner and I, and we are building them left and right. My goal is two billion with a B, two okay. billion dollars in developments of this senior assisted living and memory care. Just like you said, you know, dementia. And the memory care loss is right. so prevalent right now. So in Florida, in Virginia, in Michigan, we're building all over and coming to California. <laughs> Wonderful. That's well, there great. is, but well, so you know, right. Is, yeah. The people as and 10,000 baby boomers mm -hmm. are turning 65 every night. Exactly. Exactly. And that's why this is so important. Oh, wow. So, but the problem is your Medicare and your social security is not going to pay for it. Oh, not at all. You know, Medicare, social security only, they pay 20 days. So after 20 days, you're on your own. They'll co-pay the next 80. So really you've got 90 days to figure it out. Well, figure it out now. You've got to figure this out. And that's why the IUL is a really good way, because guess what? Inside of the IUL, mm -hmm. you actually li can live off the death benefit. So you can take, depending on what product, 2 to 4% of the death benefit to pay for the long-term care. Oh, I see. Yeah. Right? And no. all you need is a doctor to say two of your activities of daily living aren't working. Yes. Boom. That money comes out tax free and you can pay the nursing and have a quality of life nursing home. Yes. And and a lot of my high end clients make their homes into a nursing home. Oh, yeah. And they put the rails and the ramps in depending on what level of of care you need or community. So yeah. this is a this is a product that not only gives you tax-free income, but protects you with long-term care, has a death benefit that's tax-free. Yeah. If you had a terminal illness and they blow the money up so you can get alternative medicine or go around the world or whatever you want to do, yes. but a lot yeah. of benefits to it. And in the last 30 years, these have performed at five to 10 percent. Wow. And now imagine making all this money in the world that we're in with the inflation. 
7.9%. Maybe it's 11, actually, you know. No, that's why everybody's going to be spending their 401ks. And this is going to be the longest recession. It's And I'm an optimist, but 2008 is going to look like nothing because it's global right now. And it's being manipulated by big banks, world banks. So it's true. a lot more than what people watch on the on the TV. Don't believe a lot of those things you're listening because it's trying to lead people down a certain path, right? Yeah. And you're not being told the truth. You guys got to get ready. Mm-hmm. Be prepared. This is really going to, you know, it's going to be a hard time. Totally. It is. Okay. But, you know, Let me ask you, Chris, like, you know, thank you so much for giving so many great nuggets. Yeah. So what are like some of the fallouts or fears let's say this way because you've seen so many portfolios right six thousand plus so what do you think that biggest fear is you know running out of money running out of money oh my god aarp did a survey that 69 and that was before the pandemic 69 percent of people are more afraid about running out of money than death ah right 70 (laughs) percent (laughs) <laughs> oh my gosh, I know the fear was of the heights. I remember that was number one fear, falling from the heights or going up in the height. And then fear of speaking was another one. Right. But you're talking about fear of outliving your exactly. Cat. That's what you know. I have a I have a show called Money 911. Right. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and it, I mean that's how it's 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 that's you know pretty basic. So they're trying to reset the dollar. You know, they're trying to reset the currency, right? And make it digital. They want one currency on the planet. There's a big war about that, right? That's really what the war is. Well, it's between good and evil. It's the ego, money, power. That's all. Money and power, right? Money and power. The war between good and evil. So we've got to be our own government. We've got to be our own social security to manage and get through the maze that's in front of us. Hi, you are listening to Syndication Made Easy podcast. We will be right back after this short break. Hi, thank you so much. This is Vinny Chopra and thank you for subscribing to my podcast and uh, YouTube channel and Facebook pages and all the great things and LinkedIn connect with me. I come live to you every Friday at 930 Pacific with Vinny and Bo show. Please also look at that. And also the podcast, which is my apartment syndication made easy. The book I wrote to a couple of years back became international top seller uh, on Amazon international now. And then we like to bring great guests for you every week or twice a week sometime to give you a lot of great knowledge. So please subscribe. You give us five star reviews on the iTunes. The better the guests we can, you know, bring and our ranking will go higher also. Thanks again for uh, following us and really getting the most out of it. Please comment, like, share, because we would love to bring better and better material for you. And get through the maze that's in front of us. I love it. it. And it's out there. It's not like, no, I'm not, you know, you can see it. It's on the news. Totally. But like I said, you've got to be your own banker. You've got to be your own government and take control of your money. Of your life. I always say. Exactly. Of your life. You've got to really look into these things and look at the nuggets and also reach out, Chris, guys. You have given so many great uh, nuggets. Any last comments you want to say to the audience, Chris? And we'll put the links also for you. Absolutely. Yeah. Sure. Well, there's there are three things that, you know, when we do a financial fitness strategy and I'm offering everybody that's on this show complimentary financial mm-hmm. fitness strategy, you can uh, meet meet with Chris Miller dot com. That's my calendar. Mm-hmm. You can email me or phone and you'll put the, all the information in there. But mm-hmm. I want to w- leave you with a couple of things besides protection of assets mm-hmm. and you know, making sure you have the right paperwork and your money's safe mm-hmm. and you have your long-term care catastrophic protection set up. 
Mm-hmm. Leave you with a couple of things that'll help you stay on top of all the negative coming at you. Gratitude. Ah. That that's the most right. Yes. This is what I do when I get up. I kind of force myself. Good to- morning. That's what I do too, Chris. <laughs> right. In Elrod's book. I always keep on talking about yeah. it. It's yeah. Like that. I've got all these Norman Vincent Peel, Dale Carnegie. You name it. I've got it over here. But yeah. you're right. Gratitude right. and just. Aligning yourself, like Stephen Covey says, you know, true north, you've got to align yourself with exercising in the morning, of course, and then eating right. That's right. Well, I'm, you know, I'm, I've been blessed to be vegan. I'm vegan since Mm -hmm. I was a little kid. Yeah. And, and I've been blessed to, you know, be, be that way. And I actually just, before I even get out of bed, I think of five things I'm grateful for, yes. you know, and then I land my feet and, and, and walking in Jesus, walking in God, you know, I want to, you know, listen to the spirit so I can, oh. you know, be heartful with people. And I do that before I go to bed too, so that I create the atmosphere that I want to live in instead of complaining and poverty and grumpiness. Yes. I'm and it really mad. helps. What it really saying? helps. So true. Oh it's my contagious. Gosh. I don't know where my book is. I should pick it up. All right. Well, it's in your heart. The gratitude is in your heart. I don't stand <laughs> in my podcast, but today is the day. Okay. Um, I wrote this book, Positivity Brings Profitability. Right. That's it. true. Uh, one more time. Because I, my wife didn't like the last book. <laughs> oh, so I said, okay, I'm good. We've been married 42 years, Chris. And she says, Winnie, you got more to put in. So yeah. no. you got more, give more. Right. <laughs> yeah. That's, but that's the truth. And, <laughs> and, you know, healthy money is really money is just energy it's and energy. everybody spends their whole life yes. working f- for an energy that will give them freedom so imagine okay. being free in your state of mind as you're doing your whatever your gift is in the yeah. world and totally. so that it's a mindset like you said yeah. right it so totally is the mindset and you know all of us have so many negatives and we can, we have to be realist, right? That's but right. I think, I think Chris Sutton, who's going to be on my show tomorrow, uh, he's a partner in a very big company. And he mentioned when I met him on the weekend that, you know, there are the yellow, no, the white circles and the uh, red circles. And the good part is that these negative thoughts are red circles. If you kind of let them stay out there, but concentrate on the white circles of positivity. See, these other uh, negative things will stay in our mind, but let's not look at those. Let's look at the more white and then this white will overpower the red. Yeah, you know, that's exactly right. And a really good way that I do it so I can trigger myself going through the day is, you know, like I just broke this glass all over of something that was very valuable. Oh, oh well, where's the blessing in it? Everything's a blessing. Look for, okay, well, I got angry. I didn't need to get angry or, you know, take more, you know, be more prayerful, be more kind or whatever. What's the lesson in that? Right. Whatever it is. And you turn it into gratitude. You turn the negative and well, Matt, that guy didn't want to work with me. Well, it's a blessing because maybe I didn't need to work with him. That's Whatever right. it is, right? I love it. Everything's love a blessing. It. Yes. Oh, this is so great. So great. Chris, thank you for joining the show, hanging Absolutely. out with me. And guys, yes. if you liked it, this show and other shows, please like, subscribe, share. Yes. And please give, click the link below for Chris so that you could reach out and, you know, without any fee, yeah. you know, she'll be able to look at your situation. Chris, yes. thank you so much for yes. being on my show. And uh, thank you. And God thank bless you. you. Thank and you. And God you, bless you too. Yeah. Really, it's been wonderful. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.